everyone, you're with Lucy from Art Shed Angel and again I'm going to show you some more stamps today that are in the range that Couture Creations is releasing of mine. So the first thing I'm doing is I'm going to use some Yupo paper which is a synthetic paper and I have put some alcohol blending solution down and the colours I'm using here are Splendour and Mineral and they are both pearl ones. So this has a lovely pearl look to it. I'm using a, he um, a hairdryer there to dry because I don't want to overheat it and buckle the paper. Now this stamp that I'm going to use here in the Precision Press is one of my favourites because it's one that I have actually made out of metal. I do a little bit of metal work so this is actually one of my designs and I'll put some photos up one day. So I'm just using stays on ink because you need to use an ink that um, can go on a surface that is not absorbent. So it, this is like a plastic Yupo, so we don't want it to bleed or um, not work properly. So now what I'm doing is I'm going to use the same colours on some normal white smooth card and I'm using the blending um, tool here which I really love, the little heart shaped tool and I'm putting the same colours, just doing some swirls but what happens here is that it gives the paper a beautiful sheen because these are pearlescent inks and I'm just cutting it to size here because I'm going to make this a card front for the um, card that I'm creating. So those wings um, have a die cut as well and I have gone away and die cut the wings and the extra wings that you can see at the top there, they're from another card. I'm actually missing a bit of video so that one there was made and I've lost the video so I think you'll work it out from what I'm doing here though. So I'm now going to use my heart locket stamp, which that's probably my best used set of stamps. And I'm just colouring some paper so that I can stamp on it. And I'm going to stamp on it with stays on again, but I could have stamped it and embossed it with gold as well. So here I just stamp it. And that creates a lovely locket. This is one of my favourite stamps too because it is actually a locket that I've, I've got. So here I'm just cutting it out. And I'm going to darken the edges so that the actual locket stands out a little bit. I'm just using my alcohol inks. You can see there it immediately makes it stand out. So then I'm just arranging the wings and I'll be gluing this all together and it ends up with a lovely card. I've actually cut my card too short so you can see here that you know we make mistakes while we're making cards but it's really fun because we can so easily fix them. And just glue it all together. I'm just using craft glue today. You could do it raised which would be really lovely. And what's really nice is the Yupo paper has a different finish to it, to the background paper, so it looks really effective. And the last thing it needs is some sentiments, and that's part of my sentiment, steampunk sentiment set. I love designing stamps that have more than one use, so this is one way to use these wings, and I'm going to show you in the next few months lots and lots of different ways to use my stamps. So if you need ideas or you're looking for a new stamp to buy, remember these are the Steampunk Dreams stamp sets. If you like my videos, please make sure you subscribe. Thanks very much. You're with Lucy.